Hey guys, you know what time it is. It's Monday night and we're hiding in the basement from the wife and kids. I'm Ken Arnold. Johnny G. I'm in the bubble. There he is. Bubble Dan. Spin him on my finger. Go, Dan, go. Go, 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 go. Spin it, Dan, all my finger. That is hilarious. I'll never get that. I'll never grow old. It's never going to get old. It's never going to get old. All right. Little vino, huh, Dan? Oh, yep. Everybody, cheers. Cheers. I hope you have your drink, your apple teeny, your wine, whatever it is you're drinking tonight. Please. Have a drink and enjoy. Because yes. for the next hour, we're going to get silly. If it, is that all right, Dan? We, you here to get silly tonight? I'm in. I'm in. All right. Yeah, the bourbon was getting a little... Uh, my Monday nights were getting a little... Uh, <laughs> I, I finish here, and I go have another one. and It, it's like, it wasn't a Monday night, brother. It was the Tuesday morning. Right. right? Yes. right. Tuesday morning. Hey, Anthony Vincent, thanks for joining What's us, man. What's up, cuz? How you doing, man? What's up? I'm going to pop this over here. Hey, start a watch party. Don't forget. I did. Oh, did yeah. You? That's awesome. Dude, sorry. Darian, what's up? Thanks for joining. Is Darian on? Darian hey, Darian, I missed you this morning on my show. I was looking for you. Just saying. All right. I was looking for you. Jamie Durier, what's up, man? All right. My sister Annie's watching. Very cool. Very cool. Let's see. Are, are we up on the uh, page? Oh, there, there, there we are. are. We're up. Woo. All right. Let me make sure that everything's working properly here. Yep. Darian says we need silliness. He needed what? He, we need silliness. Oh, good Lord, do we need some silliness. And that's what's going to happen here tonight, Darian, because uh, I got some silly stuff to talk about. Yep. Some silly things to show you. So, yeah, I got some silly stuff to go through. All right. Um, did you guys start a watch party? I did. What, Working should, on it. Should I start a watch party? I think I should start a watch party. I think. I All thought right, you where, did. Where, but where I am I at not. here? Darian, Darian overslept. It's okay, Darian. It happens. Yeah, it happens. I, I do it every yep. once in a while, too. All right, uh, start a watch party. There it is. All right, what's going on? Why is it taking so long? Hi, Pat. Hi, Trish. How are you guys? All Thanks right, for joining. All right, Pat and Trish. Woo. All right, starting that watch party, guys. Sorry. And my mother's watching. Hi, Ma. We got 12 people on board already. Right. Hey, Mama G. You got to love it when you get 12 people right out of the gate. We got to keep them. I know it. All right. Okay, let me uh, shrink this down a little bit. That's what she said. <laughs> it's not shrinking. It's getting bigger. The water was cold. All right. <laughs> it's going in the opposite direction, boys and girls. I don't know why. Let me go. I'm gonna. I don't know why it's going in the back. It's, it's the upside down right now. That's interesting. Right? Yeah. Did you see that? Yeah. And Amy I, Young joined. Look. Yeah. What's going on? I have no clue what the hell is going on right now. Damn fangled gadgets. Damn gadgets. These gadgets, yeah, Dan. Move, you just move stuff in the way on my screen. Yep. Uh, yep. How about now? Is that yeah, better? Yeah, now we're back. Now we're back. Cool. Nice. All right. So I was blocking Dan for a second there. But now, look. Boom. I got all Amy Young's on. Will Thank Casto. You. Will Casto. Thanks for joining. I love it. Lots of people on tonight. Yeah. That's a good thing. 18 already. All right. And I am actually going to add one more thing and go back to our regular Facebook page because... I love the comments coming in over there, even though I do see most of them that come yeah. through over here. So if you guys are on tonight, do not be afraid to comment. Go yeah. on to our regular Facebook feed and comment. We won't see it if you're watching in a watch party. That's the only issue. So there's Monica's Monica. Monica's asking if she, is it because she joined? No, no. You joined. Thank you, Monica, for joining us. We appreciate it. Thank you so much. Yes, we do. Thank you. All right. Let me go back over here. I'm going to bring this up because it's, oh, no, that's my watch party. I can't do that. Oh, man. Oh, man. So, Dan, how's your week going, man? You doing good over there? Doing okay, yeah. You doing all right? What are you guys doing? We're doing all right. Yeah, uh, you know, making making do with uh, yep. things that are going on in the yep. world. Um, I'm alive. Yep. Just want to get back to work. You know, they released the rules for production on sets that are pretty strict, so I don't know how that's going to work out. All yeah, right. I, haven't, I haven't read them yet. You haven't read them yet. Well, you know, no. they're pretty strict. And, and I'm telling you right now, they're going to be strict. And they're going to go after people who do not follow the rules. And that that's what should happen. Mm -hmm. um, they've already shut down a couple productions already. So I'm going to put the comments right dead in the center. Yep. So that's my cousin Anthony saying hello to my sister. All right. All right. Johnny G's yep. sister's on. Yep. And Anthony's on. And yep. your mom's on. Yep. It's, it's Carl Houtman, what's up, buddy? It's a family D reunion. D. Wayne just joined. Hmm. That's a good Who appetini, that? Johnny. I mean, right. well, I, I should just say it's just a good glass of vodka. <laughs> <laughs> the 
With a tint of green. With a tint of green food coloring right. just for uh, right. looks. So we've got a Thomas Arnold that joined. Is that a Bring related? Lysol. Thomas Arnold. Yeah, that's my cousin Bo. All right. Yeah, we call him Bo. James Saylor. Yep, James Saylor. He's a friend of mine I went to high school with. Nice. Yeah, so James yeah, I tell you what, I, I, what I don't know in all of this is how the porn industry is going to start back up. Uh, uh, that's a good point, I man. I don't we, know. We can't do normal movies. You know, how are they going to do their business? I, I'm pretty sure they're, Body not, condoms. they're not going to follow their rules, period. They're right. not. So. When did they ever? Yeah. Richard Brown, how we doing, hey, guys? Up, We're doing good, Richard Brown. Thanks for joining, man. The Redskins still stink. Yep. Oh, did I say that out loud? I'm sorry. That's sorry, right. Dave. Hey, real quick. He's a regular. Congratulations, Richard. I saw you got a new place. He new, did. New, new home. Got a new condo, Richard nice. Brown. Yeah, it's a pretty nice looking place. So now you can sit there and you can watch the Redskins lose in luxury. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's awesome. Oh, you can sit in a nice apartment and watch them get their butts whooped. <laughs> By the Eagles and everybody else. Except the Cowboys. Beat the Cowboys. Please. Yeah. Mm. My cousin Kathy just joined. Hey, My buddy Kathy. Nick Skinner. What's up, Nick? Hey, Kathy. We got 23 people. Ron on. Wagner. What's up, Ron? Let's get to some stuff here, man. We got to get to our regular yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah. We got to get to our regular stuff. Yep. And I'm going to jump right in. We're going to yeah. go right to our What Chaps Your Ass segment. Here we go, Johnny G. I'm ready. Just for you. Woo. What Chaps Your Ass. <laughs> so, everybody out there, start commenting. What chaps your ass? Right. right. Let's go. Let's have some fun with this. What chaps your ass? So, Johnny G, give it to me, man. And don't say Miracle Whip. No. Well, oh, that's for a different show. All right. So, Bye. what chaps my ass is, you know, we've been... I hate Miracle Whip, man. Yeah. Shut Thank Jesus, you, Dan. Thank criminal, you. Both of you. Thank you, Dan. I can't be your friend now. <laughs> Either one of you. Can I used I, to you like are... it, but I had a bad experience with it. We'll just nah. leave it at that. Sandwich just isn't a sandwich, Dan Franco. You know that. <laughs> yeah, mayonnaise. I'll, I'll stick with mayonnaise. Mayonnaise? Yep. Oh, that's mayonnaise. like eating paste. That's nah, like eating... mayo is good. You guys ate glue in school, didn't you? No. Yeah. We didn't. Eat mayonnaise, it's the I same didn't. thing. Yeah. It's the same thing. No, it's actually egg whites and olive oil. But anyway. Um, so what chaps my ass. So we've been in this COVID thing for a few months now. And what chaps my ass is the uncertainty along with it not knowing what's going to happen in the next couple of months. People are saying, yeah, we're going to open up or we're going to close. We might have baseball. We might not have baseball. I just need to know what's going to happen. So it's kind of... I need a little more certainty in my life. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I don't know. I've been I've been living on the edge now for three and a half months, right. not knowing what's going down. Right. And now, you know, one day they tell me I can do this, and then the next day they're going to yank out the carpet right underneath. Right. Nope, you can't do that. Yep. Bing. And then here exactly. I am. I don't know. I, I agree. I'm with you. Yeah. The uncertainty of it all is uh, chaps my ass. It's, right. But, you know, we we have to kind of find our way through it right now. Yeah. As best we can, you know, and uh, try to stay safe, try to keep your family healthy and try to keep your friends healthy. And exactly. Do what you got to do yep. to make that happen. So, because there's a lot of people out there who really could care less. Yeah. About anything. Yep. Rules of any kind. They yep. just, whatever, mask, nope. Social distance? Uh-uh. Yep. Yep. They don't care. You know. Licking toilets? On it. On it. I'm good. I can do that. <laughs> I'm on it. Uh, I'm on it. <laughs> I might draw the line there. The question is, why would that pop into Dan's head? <laughs> no, that's what those dumbasses were doing right before this all started. True. Like that's right. No, you're you're yeah. exactly right. You are right. They were licking yep. toilets. Mm. Maker Sandy. Hi, Meg. All right. D. Wayne says, this show... Yeah, 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 chaps his ass. Okay, D Wayne. You love it. You love, you love it, you and you love it. us. You know you do. Yep. There's Jamie no Nash. certainty. Kathy says there's no certainty in anything right now. That's true. There is no certainty. I guess if there is something certain, like the amount of work I get around done done around the house, that's certain now. And I'm learning some new things to cook. That's a good thing, too. Yeah. I'm pretty certain that I try to find ways to avoid doing shit all day long. <laughs> <laughs> That's a certainty. I'm just like, ah, well, I'll do this for a little while. Yeah, yeah, I'll do that for a little while. And I never get to do whatever I'm supposed to do. Right. So, yeah, that's what I'm good at. That's a good segue into mine. Yeah. Go ahead, we, Dan. Uh, so we've been working in the backyard for, for weeks. You know, we did our deck. We, we've... Our house is on a, a pretty steep incline, so um, we found a, a flat-ish part that we, we started digging in and trying to level off, and we, we were pretty sure we had it level. I laid a piece of wood down and put a level down, and 
you know, it wasn't completely, but it wasn't all the way over. So right. put that pole up and showed it up, and <laughs> we have a deep end and a shallow end. So it, uh, it's got a little well, tilt, to a it. Right. tilt to it. Mm. So. That happens. The, the pool water guy said we'll be okay for this year, but we'll want to go in after the season, take the pool down, and, and go back to work on it. But, God, yeah. I was so pissed, man. I'm watching this this thing fill up, and I was like, oh, uh, son of a bitch. <laughs> Yeah, yeah it happens, water man. doesn't lie. Mm-mm. Water yeah. will tell you the truth every single time. Be like water, my right. friend. That's a Bruce Lee. Right. Uh, let's see what uh, what chaps Richard Brown's ass is. Essential workers getting verbally abused by customers. That is correct. Yeah, that chaps my ass. That's a pain well. in the ass. Yeah, they yeah, don't deserve I've it. Seen that? They do not deserve that uh, at all. In Unless they suck. <laughs> Unless they suck at what they do, then they might deserve it. But for the most part, they don't deserve it. <laughs> Uh, what chaps Darian's ass is when you miss the last step on a stairway, but you catch yourself going <laughs> on. No, that is a good one. I hate that, that is too. a good one. But most times, I miss that last step, and I never catch myself. <laughs> and that really chaps my yeah. ass and hurts my ass because I lay Bruises it. Yeah, it bruises my ass. Uh, Monica says, she's fearless. She even joined this live show. Oh. Thank you, Monica, for joining the live show. We appreciate that. And does that chap your ass that you joined our show? Because it shouldn't. You should be glad to be here. That's right. Everybody that joins yeah. the show loves seeing us. Joe Hansard's on. Hey, Joe. What's hey, up, Joe? Joe? What's happening, buddy? What's happening? Everybody wants to drive the Zamboni. That's what you know for certain. Everybody does want to drive. I do. I wouldn't mind driving it. Hell, I know Dan I'll wants drive to drive anything. it. Dan, have you ever driven a Zamboni? I've never driven a Zamboni. I drove, I drove one in Thunder Bay, Canada one time. Eh? It was it was it was a moosing. It was a moosing. It was eh? a moosing. Yeah, it eh? was amazing. It was a moosing, eh? It was you a hoser. moosing. A yeah. moosing. Take off, hoser. <laughs> <laughs> you hose head. <laughs> Chris Finley, what's up, brother? How you doing? Uh, Jeff Sprawl, how you doing, buddy? And your sister joined, Rob Minoli joined. Rob Minoli. Joe Hanser's drinking Shasta. There you I go, love Joe. Shasta. Yeah, Shasta. That's I good. like the grape Shasta. The grape. I they still make the that? Grape. I, I guess Joe's yes, drinking it, unless he had a case from like 1982. I don't know. <laughs> it's like that. It's like that Dharma beer on Lost or Tab. Yep, yep. All right. So what taps my ass? I don't know. You tell me. I, you know, I'm gonna get a little serious. You know, what taps my ass is uh, <laughs> Dan looking at you. I'm gonna get a little serious, <laughs> Dan. I'm gonna get a little serious. I'll look at you. Go that ahead, was ready? great. Dan. Let's look at each other, Dan. You ready? <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Really? Okay. That's outstanding. All right. So uh, what chaps my ass is, uh, you know, when things happen to your friends, uh, bad things, and you can't be there to help them. Mm-hmm. And you can't, you know, that chaps my ass. It really chaps my ass. I wish, uh, you know, there was something you can do, but there really isn't sometimes. You just, you know. The only Especially thing, now. Yeah. And the only thing you can do is just, you know, send your support to them. Or, right. you know, Say a prayer. Whatever it is you do to send the support that you send to your friends. That chaps my ass when you, when you can't be there for your friends. And uh, that's it. That's, you know. Sorry to bring everybody down. I apologize. But, okay. Okay. No, Darian. The Zamboni is not a car. It should it, be, though. That'd be pretty cool. Yeah, and it's not a setup to a dirty joke. <laughs> Zamboni. Zamboni. <laughs> the Zamboni is not some sexual toy or anything like that. It's All the right. thing that they... Go ahead, Dan. You tell. You're the hockey it's guy. The, it's, the, it's the brand name of an ice resurfacing machine. It is the brand name. Yes. It's yeah. like sheet rock. There's other, there's other versions. They get really mad when you call it a Zamboni. Mm-hmm. Really? Yep. And you ready? Don't ever call it a Zamboni unless it is a licensed Zamboni. Oh. <laughs> That's a xylophone. It's only a Zamboni if it's from the Zamboni region of France. Otherwise, it's just a sparkling resurfacer. Ah, yes. Ah. Good one. That's a good one. Thank you very much, Dan. Thank you. Yay. Very well. Very well done, Dan. Well played, sir. Well played. You ready? Inconceivable. I got a whole list of new new sound effects this week, by the way. So we can sit here all day. We can do Princess Bride. We can do all kinds of different things. Right? We can do Dave Chappelle. Gotcha, bitch. <laughs> we can do Ron Burgundy. <gasps> oh, great Odin's Raven. <laughs> <laughs> we can do this. Hi, kids. Do you remember this one? Here's an important message from your Uncle Bill. Don't <laughs> buy drugs. 
get famous. Become a pop star and they give you them for oh, free. Uh, they give them to you for free. <laughs> you become a pop star, they'll give you drugs for free. Nice. I love it. Because that's the way to go. That's the way to go. And yeah. here's my favorite of all time. Ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time. Ain't nobody got time. Ain't nobody got time for that. Woo! I love that. I love that. Ain't nobody got time for that. All right, so I got some cool videos this week, Dan. Did you see any of these cool videos? I saw a couple. You saw a couple. All right, let's see what I got here. All right, oh, 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 oh. Look at this one. This is an article that I found today. <laughs> this is just... I found this article, Dan, today on the interwebs, and I double-checked it to make sure if it was true. Turns out it is. Are you ready? Here we go. I'm going to uh, go here, and then I'm going to share my screen, and here we go. Don't want to share that screen. I want to say... I wanna... It's not a bad screen. Boom. But... There it is. Man with dead fish found up his backside, said he accidentally sat on it. Uh-huh. <laughs> That's what happened. <laughs> oh, my God. Careful. Oh, <laughs> uh, look. And then you go further down. Uh, are you still uh, there, Dan? Are you still we don't there? need to go further down. <laughs> I'm still here. And look. And there it is. Look Holy at it. You can see it. Cow. Right here. In the right, right in between his pelvis. His, his hips. It looks like right a in koi. His it's his fish. What is... Oh, wait. What is that on the bottom left there? Over... That's his schwanz. Oh, his Jesus. His schwanz stickle. <laughs> that's his, that's, that's a, a dick fish. His, his schlange. It's a dick fish. His, it's a dick fish. It's his, <laughs> it's his grosser schlange is what it is. No, but I'm saying, dude got a fish stuck. That's a terrible, butt. man. Why? And then he told a lie. He went in and he, he said. sat on it. I sat on it and it I went up there. Right. Come on, just mm -hmm. be honest. I stuck it up there. That's not what happened. I buddy. wanted to see what it felt like and it was kind of fishy. <laughs> That's my, one, of my favorite, one of my favorite lines from Scrubs is that. Uh, <laughs> Either he shoved the light bulb up his ass or his colon has a great idea. <laughs> oh, I just spit my... I just spit my apple teeny yeah, all over my did. computer. And my leg. And now, That was so awesome. If the computer cuts out, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. Oh, that was great. Hmm. A little oh. bit of ass douchey. Oh, there. I got it off. Woo. But man, that was bad. Now Adam gotta... Patterson, Ron Holman. What's up, guys? Thanks for joining the transformation to morning zoo is complete that's right the transformation is complete you got to come on the morning show jamie nash but you're probably not up you probably slept in like darian did yep and there's darian learning something new every day about the damn zamboni right. i'm guessing damn right right well, monica says she's got a question for you ken uh-oh what is what monica who monica lafont okay what is it Go ahead, Monica. Ask your question. In the meantime, I'm going to go into <laughs> Joe Hanchard's How's Ed versus Ken Smackdown going? Well, I got to say, this week, Joe, uh, didn't go so well for me. I dropped 5000 down to 45000 and Ed went up 5000 to 23000 So mm. it kind of increased the gap there for me to make up. But there's still two weeks left, so I have a chance. Yep. Right? I do. I have a chance. And... Uh, so you're telling me there's a chance. <laughs> yes! yes! That's right. You're telling me there's a chance. There is a chance. Yep. There, there is. is a chance. There's so keep following us over there. Yeah. Um, we picked our charity, and that's going to pop up soon, too. So you guys can uh, come on board, vote for either Ed or myself. I, I say me. And then, uh, you know, donate to the charity. It's going to be fun. Yep. It's going to be fun. Hey, my so, son just joined. What's up, bud? All right, uh, Darian Rothschild said, well, he redefined the term catfished. <laughs> That's a good one, Darian. Yeah, he did. That is a good one. All right, so who made that drink fro me, fro you? Okay, well, I'm going to tell you, Monica. The guy sitting right here, right next to me, made that drink for me. Johnny G made me my apple teeny. Actually, it's just vodka straight with a little it touch is, of green with, stuff With a in drop it. of green dye in it. <laughs> That's all it is. But uh, Johnny makes a good apple teeny. Yeah. Especially when they're strong. Heavy on the teeny. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Heavy on the teeny. Let me tell you something. A couple teenies and you're tuned. Teeny tuned. Yep. Teeny tuned yep. is what you are. Yeah, we teenies. got a lot of people joining here. Yeah. So one of my favorite people of all time joined, Ronald Rossi. My best friend's, right. my best, my best friend, friend's father growing up. Thanks for joining, Mr. Rossi. Very Love cool. You. Very cool. Troy Knoll, what's up, buddy? 
All right, so we're getting into it. Uh, the fish was Ed's. Was the Ed? Oh, the fish. That fish was Ed versus Ken's update. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly how I felt this week, <laughs> Jamie. Like I did get a fish shoved up my butt. All right. Uh, yeah, down went Ken this week. Down went Ken. Felt yeah. like I got a knockout punch. I dropped five. He went up five. That's a big gap, but I can make it up. I yeah, can right. make it up. All right. So, did you see this one, Dan? I got more fun oh, videos. Jesus. Yeah, you're going to love this one. Here we go. You ready? There it is. The hands-free sperm collecting machine. Let me go up here and play that for you. Check it out. In China. Check that out, Dan. Right? You go, if you go to the sperm collection clinic, oh. they have these machines so you don't have to do it yourself. For men who are too embarrassed to masturbate. And they have them all lined up. So they're too embarrassed to masturbate, but they'll stand in a line next to each other, like at a urinal, <laughs> and do what? it. How ridiculous is that? Look! And that guy's like, I'm next. I'm, I'm going to adjust it to my size. That's way too big for him. You can increase the speed. Oh, this is awesome. Look at that. Ah! <laughs> I hope my mother's not watching. Prevent contamination. Okay. <laughs> Jamie said he accidentally got that instead of a ring doorbell. <laughs> How ridiculous is that? That's so ridiculous. Oh my, my god. god, the sperm collecting machine in China. Dan, would you use the sperm collecting machine? I would not. Mm. Even if they cleaned it for COVID reasons? No. Yeah, the, no. there's not a... That, no. No. Even after a couple of Abeltinis? No. Still no. Still no. no. No, I think there's a there's a level of uh, cleanliness that I'm not sure is happening. Um, now yeah. look, I'm now, saying, if, if you if you can guarantee I'm the first person ever to use the machine, you're not. You, you know what? About it. You're not. Dude, they had to test it on somebody. Dude, sloppy seconds, man. Ah, uh, oh, somebody had to go there. Somebody had to say it. Uh, <laughs> your mother said yuck. Yeah, my mom's watching. <laughs> anyway. I didn't realize. I didn't anyway. realize Fleshlight got into the medical <laughs> Chris, industry. Chris Mueller said he'd use it if he was first. Anyway, Adam Patterson right here dropped it on us. Amazing technology. That is correct because there you go, right? You, you go into the place, you just stand there, and boom, take care of itself, mm. right? You don't have to worry about it. Just let the machine do it, Yeah. right? Man, it's hard enough to take a leak with someone standing next Seriously, to you. Seriously, man. <laughs> Jamie said he accidentally got that. Fright. He accidentally got that instead. Of, excuse me, instead <laughs> of a ring doorbell. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and when they delivered it, Jamie, was it wrapped in brown paper, a big box, and then the Amazon guy came up, or the Amazon <laughs> woman came up and was like, "Yeah, we know what this is, buddy. We know what it is. We know what you're doing here." Because they do. They can sniff it out. They know exactly what it is. <laughs> Adam said it's probably only weird the first time. <laughs> All right. Let's see. All right. Let's see. My mom says, my mom said, wait a minute. We got to go back now. All these comments are coming in now. Would you trust Dick? Would I trust him with my wiener? No. I, I don't know. Maybe. We'll see. Right? My mom says, yuck. Chris Mueller said, I'd use it if I was first. Right? <laughs> Just like Dan. Right? Monica said, Ken Arnold, ha ha, the reason why I asked is the spelling on the month of June. Appletini's Jubilee. I noticed that, that too. Yeah. I didn't want to point it out. I was in a rush. I was in a rush. You know, and what happens is when you start typing in a rush, you spell Jaboon. Jubney. Instead of <laughs> Jubney. Instead of, Jubney. Jubney instead of June. The golden tiki of Jaboodney. Yes. <laughs> Dan, just wear a mask. It's all good. <laughs> <laughs> That's my son. That's good. Yes, Megan Wilson, what's up, kid? Jamie Nash said he's got an idea for a Black Mirror episode. <laughs> and my mom double, doubled up. Ooh. <laughs> she went yuck to ooh. <laughs> and it's probably only weird the first time. After that, and I'm telling you, it's a great oh, industry man. right now. And I know Kurt Howard said this uh, on my other show. But truck stops. It's a great truck stop business. <laughs> right? You, oh buy, my God. Buy one, you buy one of those machines. You know they're not getting cleaned. <laughs> you go in. You stand in front of the machine for a couple minutes. <laughs> and then you go get your shower. Boom. Back in your truck and you're on the road. Ugh. And you're on the road. And you don't have to worry about, you know, 
Any of the getting the, arrested? The, yeah, getting arrested. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Ending up in a truck stop sting. Yeah. yeah. I mean, that's probably it's probably uh, the uh, business of the future. That's all I'm saying. I'm gonna what happens if you're a uh, a world famous orange person with small hands? Can't you you can't fit in the machine? <laughs> they probably have an adapter. Yeah. <laughs> you know, reach out. <laughs> Dirk Fox, what's if up? The, if they put the wheels on it and gave it an engine, commuting would be, <laughs> it would tolerable. be tolerable. <laughs> that, is, that is right, Chris. It would be tolerable. Yep. Put a Megan Fox poster on that thing. Nobody asks questions. Megan Fox is hot. Megan Fox is hot. We haven't said that on the show. We have a long time. Go back to the season one. Yep. Yeah, that's a long time ago. Megan Fox is hot. Megan Fox is hot. <laughs> Megan Ponson's That's on. funny. Now we're going to sit here and sing that for the rest of the right. show. We're just going to go ping Thanks, pong. Thanks, John. It. Thanks, Johnny. We need to record that so you can have it as a sound right. bite. You can just yeah. Megan Megan Fox is hot. All right, did you see this, Dan? It's just still, I'm not sure. It's, that was like 10 years ago. Yeah. You ready? Can You you ready for this? this? This is our last show. I'm just telling you right now. Am I right? Okay. Because, Boom. Alternate reading of the mind calendar suggests end of the world is next week. Oh. Yeah. We might get one more show in. Maybe. Maybe. So, you know, we got to have fun this show just yeah. in case we yeah. don't get to that. Right. Because uh, they didn't really say if it was going to be at the beginning of the week, like right, and you know, Sunday turns to Monday. Yeah. So we might not get the show in next week. So. Yeah. Uh, Let's geez. pray for one yeah, more show. Work for me because you know Hamilton comes out on Disney Plus in three weeks, so uh-huh. that, that, that I can't make that work. Oh, but anyway, you know the Mayans, they haven't been right yet, have they? Have Not, they? No. The last if they few times were, they've been way be, off. We wouldn't be here. I know. Do you remember the one where they said that the the world was going to end? It was uh, how many years ago was that? I don't know. It wasn't too Y2K? long ago. Y two K. No, it wasn't Y two K. But no, it was it was um, it was like uh, it was the Rapture guy, and he and he moved his date like three times. Yeah, and it was like December twenty first or whatever it was, or some something silly. Well, on that day in Annapolis, a transformer by the mall went out. I remember that, right? Yep. And all the power in Annapolis just went out. Boom! Yep. On that day, and a big glowing light in the sky was purple, yep. and it was just glowing purple the sky. And everybody was freaking out. They were yep. like, oh, my God, the Mayans were right. We're yep. all going to die. It, it was, was crazy. My kids were freaking out. They were like, oh, my God, Dad, yeah. what are we going to do? I'm like, it's fine. Don't worry. Sit down. Light a candle. I'll make a fire. <laughs> so, but, man, that freaked us out. We were yep. like, oh, we're all going to die. It was crazy. Stupid Mayans. Man. But they've, they've been wrong. They haven't been right. Nope. Dan, I've, I've got more fantastic video for you, by the way. If you're ready. Yeah, I'm sure you do. Are you ready for this fantastic? I, there's video? one I know that's coming at some point. What's that? Nothing. Go ahead. This was this is one of Johnny's favorites. <laughs> yeah. Here you go. You ready? We're gonna we're that's gonna play one. this one. Boom. Here we go. This guy was jamming by the pool. Right. Here we go. Uh. Mm, uh. 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 Eh. Oh. Yeah. Boom. Boom. Mm. Look at him go. He just told her, social distance, baby, I don't have a mask. The girl in the pool, Johnny G, look at her. Ah. Uh. Woo! Go, oh, oh, and now we're buffering. Yep. I did like the other buffering. one picking her wedgie coming out of the pool, though. Oh. Is that what that move's called, buffering? It's buffering, <laughs> it's dude. It's buffering. Totally buffered, man. Wow, now we can't watch it. You're gonna miss the you missed the whole poll action. Yeah, dude. Has uh, the whole unfortunately, poll I I didn't miss it. I saw the morning show. Oh, did you? Damn. Yeah. Well, anyway, totally, totally. He starts working the poll. He's like, boom, 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 what do you think boom. his reasoning behind it was? I, he was drunk. <laughs> he was probably drunk. Okay. <laughs> but I don't. What are people thinking right now? Dude is just flipping out. I don't know. I have There's no something idea. in that pool like every single Saturday, this fucking guy. <laughs> <laughs> we got a couple people like that at our pool. In his beha- banana hammock. We got a couple banana hammock uh, guys over at our pool. Yeah. It's a lot of fun. Ain't nobody got time for it's that. It's a lot of fun. Ain't nobody got time for that. Hold up. Hold up now. Let's get in here. I'm going to tell you right now. <laughs> Your mother said he's such a nerd. Who my mother said I was? <laughs> yeah. Oh, Jesus. Ain't nobody got time for that. 
Anybody got time for that, Dan Franco? <laughs> yeah, my son. <laughs> Jamie <laughs> said Channing Tatum's got to eat. Yeah. That's right. Joe Hansard says, Mayan. Yep. It's just, my mom says it's just a tad depressing, don't you think? I don't th I don't think that guy was depressing. I thought he was having a good time with his Speedo. And he was smacking his butt. He yeah, went, he was. Bing, we didn't get to see that. Bing. They didn't get to see that. I know, though. they didn't get to see it, but, yeah. you know, I thought it was kind of amazing. Uh, such a yeah, it's in there, like, uh, he, he was, um, who was the guy on Saturday Night Live? Uh, um, Mango? Mm-hmm. Yeah. He, he was smacking his, yeah. He was smacking his own butt? Yep. <laughs> Ain't no laws when you're drinking claws. Some, sometimes you gotta dance. <laughs> the white claws. I love yeah. the white claw. No, I don't. I've never so had awesome. one. I've never had one. You drink those? Oh, no. I don't think so. But I'll drink a good apple teeny. Me too. Right These are good apple teenies. Paul Mazzaro, <laughs> what's like, up? How are you doing, man? Oh, no. We're losing people fast. We're down to 13. We were up to 28. Now we're down to 13. We gotta bring them what back. What happened? We gotta bring them back. We gotta bring them back. I got. Give that I got guy it. a sperm collector bot. I got. <laughs> yep. That's exactly what we need to do. I'm gonna get that sperm collector bot, and here we go. Here we go. The show's gonna rebound right now. You ready? Here you go, Johnny. You ready? Yep. Do you see these things to buy for your dogs? I love these things. I wanna get one. I'm gonna get one for my dog. Ain't nobody getting time for that. Ain't nobody getting time for that. Here we go. I got it. Did you see this, Dan? <laughs> yes. <laughs> you gotta get one for your dog. Look. Ding, 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 ding. They even have the Western music playing. It's like, That's yeah. great, man. What is it, eight seconds? Right? You gotta stay on for eight seconds? Yeah. Yeah. That's so good. Look at that. I so want to get one of those for my dog and then just torture her <laughs> in the backyard with it. Yeah. Just have her run around. It's like, <laughs> those things are so goddamn cool. That's crazy looking. I know, I want one. I want one. And you know what? Just to make everybody feel really good, check this dude out. Yeah. Look at this guy. Old dude's getting it. 102 years old. This is how he gets his eggs exercise every day. At that. Boom, boom. The nurses were like hilarious too. Watch them. Yeah, them. they are. Watch them. They're jamming. Mm -mm -mm. Look at him. He's like, I don't need no mask. Check it out. <laughs> wiggle, wiggle. I'll Somebody's tell you right now. To change his diaper after that. I'll tell you right now. When I'm 102 years old, I'm hoping I'm able to do that. Right. Right. I'm hoping I can do that next week. <laughs> right. <laughs> oh. Dan says nothing. He's just Coach smiling. Stokes. What's up? No, I don't talk when you put dancing things on because I I don't want to sexy you know, dance. You don't want to fall into yeah. The sexy I don't want to. I don't want to poke the bear. Oh. Monica brought up a good question. Where are the rest of the Italians? That's a good question. <laughs> Give that guy a sperm collector bot. <laughs> Ooh. The guy should call Chippendales. The old man. Yeah, <laughs> the hundred two year old guy. <laughs> Not that other guy by the pool, man. He was terrible. He was no, terrible. Nobody wants to see that guy. Oh, my mom meant the guy in the Speedo was a nerd. Oh, uh, uh, she me. asked if he could have his number. Oh, did she? She did. Wow, Mom. Mm. That's oh, yeah, a little That's too cool. much for me. Where are the rest of the Italians tonight? Monica wants to know. What What's wrong with Germans or, or Limeys? There's enough Italian people. right here between what? me and Dan, isn't there? What about the Irishman in the group? <laughs> what about him? It cracks me up. I'm a little bit of everything. I'm Nordic. I'm Irish. I'm Malimey. I'm German. A little bit country. A little bit rock and roll. Right. A little bit of all of it. I'm a mutt. I'm a mutt. Sorry. Sorry. And my mom said I made a point that I am a nerd. What? Yep. Ban from the show. Ban hammer. Done. Psh, boom. Wait a minute. What do we have to banner? Let's play it. <laughs> You're banned, mom. You're the rest of the night. Don't even comment. I'm not getting up. You're not getting up on the board. Matt Mitchell. What's up, jackass? Oh, Matt Mitchell. Do we have anything for Matt Mitchell? How about a party noise? <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> oh, oh my god. All right, so uh, let's get to our top five. Our top five. Yeah, top five. top five. Yep. Right? Yep. Top five. We went through all these crazy, stupid videos that uh, I happened to find during the week because I got nothing better to do with myself. Yep. Uh, let's get to uh, some of the top five stuff. Yeah. All right. Let's see. Oh, did you see? I got one more video for you guys. Did you see the girl try to save the squirrel? No. Oh, yes. Yes, you I did. You didn't see it? All right, let me show you I this did. one. All right, Dan, Dan's seen it, but Johnny G hasn't seen it. Check this out. Uh oh, there he is again. We gotta get, we gotta rid of this guy. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Wiggle, wiggle. Where's the girl? There it is. She tries to save the squirrel. Watch this, Johnny G. See the squirrel in the pool? It's in the pool, yeah. It's in the pool. It looks like he's doing he's okay. He's swimming in the pool. Yep. He's doing okay. He's swimming. He's staying afloat, right? But listen to the the, the mom. She comes on. Look, she sneaks in. Here it is. Don't touch it. Ready? Don't touch him. Don't touch him. That's a Texas Don't accent. Touch him. Don't, Don't touch, him. touch him. Don't touch him. Get a board. Get a board. What? She gets a chair. Yeah, Even better. Leave some room for Jesus. Yep, here it comes. Look, she's trying to get him. Look, the squirrel's like, get away from me, bitch. Get away from <laughs> me. Look, I scared the crap out of it. And then she's like, I'm trying to save you. I'm trying to save you. Let me save you. Let me save you. <laughs> and then watch, watch. Yep. Whoa! Oh! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Look, and she's crying. Ladies. She's crying. <laughs> it's a squirrel. Oh, it's just a squirrel, but it jumped on her. That's, That's awesome. It wanted to give her she a She would have just left the chair in the pool. The right. The squirrel would have taken care of the rest. Yep. Yeah, it, it wanted to give her a hug. Because it saved, you know, she saved it. She saved it. My mom, my mom, mom, you got to comment. If you're going to, you know, I can't put your comment up, right? That's ridiculous. That, that, no, what does that, it say? It's just empty. It's, oh. her, it's her version of a deadpan. Yeah. <laughs> it is. It's just empty. She's just get, she's, she's stonewalling me. She's ghosting me, Dan. She's ghosting me. Uh, my mom asked, can, can, can I have his number? What, the guy with the Speedo on? Is that the guy? Uh, who knew? My mom. All right. He's really aged since the pool dance. <laughs> he really has that guy. He has, yeah. He has. All right. We're catching up now. We're catching up. Look at all these comments that are I coming know, in. I love it. We're up to yeah, 19. In like pumps. We're back up to 19 people again. Nice. Boom, boom, boom. We dropped down to 13. Now we're back up to 19. Pew, 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 pew. <laughs> Let's do our top five, Dan. Pew, pew. Are you ready? Let's do it. What's our top five this week? Johnny G, what are we talking about? Our top five this week is things you miss during this whole COVID timeout thing. Yeah, we're all in timeout, essentially. It is. We're all in timeout. Right? Everybody's in timeout. So yeah. what, what do you miss? What are your top five so things? So my top five, and don't be afraid, you know, please comment what you guys miss. But my top five, my number five is shaking hands. Uh, shaking hands is a big part for me of seeing what type of person you are. First impressions are everything. When they, when they say that, it's true. When you shake somebody's hand, you can tell what type of person they are. So I miss that. Oh, we're back down to 13 people again, John. Oh, shoot. We just threw people off. Hey, you, you threw in human interaction, and people were like, nope. No, I'm, I'm out. out. I'm out. I'm yep. out. <laughs> so my number four was concerts and movies. Going to the concerts and movies, I really miss that stuff. It's uh, live music to me is always great, and being able to see that stuff is really important to me. Um, number three, working. I miss working. Mm. I miss working. Yep. I hate not working. Yeah. Yeah. Um, number two, gatherings, parties, whatever. Just seeing people, you know, that you haven't seen in forever. Um, my son says he missed spitting game with the ladies. I see that. Yeah. I see that. My son. Yeah. Um, my number one is baseball. I I really miss watching baseball games. So it right. stinks. Fair enough. Yeah. It does stink. Yep. Well, actually, Major League Baseball, I could care less now at this point. Yeah. You yeah, screw them. Yeah. You don't want to play? Don't play. I, I'm not going to lose any sleep over it, and I'm not going to, you know, I'll go down to the park and watch the kids play. It'll be more interesting, and they actually want to be there. So, right. Yeah. It's annoying. All right. So uh, somehow Rocky and, and got they'll actually, separated. They'll let, 
They'll let you bang on the trash can when someone throws the uh, the change up sign. That's right. That's right. Hey, I'm always out there. That only happens signs. in Houston. Mm-hmm. Hell, in Boston. And Pal Park. Or maybe New York. No, and, not New York. And maybe in Philadelphia, too, when they only won 66 games. <laughs> That's the rumor. <laughs> I was like, well, if you were stealing signs well, was, and only won 66 games, yeah. how bad were you? Right. <laughs> That was a big thing when the Orioles, when all those Orioles got the, uh, the um, Tejada and and uh, Palmero were all getting, like Juice you won up. like twelve games and you still roided like what? Yeah, right. Exactly. So I got to put my mom back on the show because uh, she doesn't want the number of the guy by the pool. She wants the old guy's number, oh. the hundred and two year old dude. <laughs> Come on, mom. Yeah. That's just wrong. And my wife is watching too. Hi, honey. Oh, is she? Yeah. Well, how do we know? How do we I know? I can see right here. Heather All Jane right. was watching. Jamie Nash says, and my, okay, playing patty cake. You miss okay. his playing patty cake. Right. <laughs> so I want I want to comment on my son's comment because I was thinking the same exact thing. What's my that? son said, thank God for commas. Okay. Because of your mother's comment, it says... <laughs> <laughs> Okay, wait, we got to go back, Dan. We got to go back. Here's my mom's comment. We got to bring mom back on the show. And thank God my mom is smart enough to use commas. Because here we go. My mom says her comment was, what are the things that you miss? Eating out other people, my grandchildren. I got to put that in there. Eating out other people, my grandchildren. Thank God for commas is right, Johnny. <laughs> Johnny. Oh. Oh. Here's to Johnny, man. Well played. Oh, well played, Johnny. Oh, Thank God. God for commas because <laughs> it could have got bad. It could have got ugly quick. Not only oh does she... I'm sure there's a bot for that. Yes. Not only does she want to date the old guy because of his insurance policy, but now she's eating out other people. <laughs> And her grandchildren. Wait a second. Are you out of your mind, lady? Oh, Jesus. Those are my kids. That's You're not crazy. eating any of them out. That's oh, wrong. my God. That's just wrong. <laughs> That's mm. terrible. Thank you, John, for that. Thank you, Johnny. Wow. Thank you. Well played, Johnny. Uh, <laughs> and she also misses the casino, by the way, my mom. Eating it out or just going to it? <laughs> Oh, there it is. Pick your last one. Uh, gutter. Yep, there it is. You guys are gutter. Oh, Jamie misses going to. All right, let, let's go back because we're uh, getting clumps of comments now. All right, let's that go back. That was awesome. Darian says going to the movies. Therapeutic. <laughs> right? Jamie Nash, motorboating. <laughs> no shit, dude. I miss it too. Stop, man. <sighs> Oh, I know. I, I miss a good motorboat. Because, <laughs> you, know, you know, walking down the street, boom, it's just motorboat. You can't do that anymore. Oh, you can't anymore. Did you ever? Did you ever do that, Johnny? The answer is no. The answer would be no, Johnny. You've never done that. Oh, God. I've never done that. What, why would <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> that is so crazy. Oh. Jay Judy, what's up, brother? Motorboating. Okay. Oh, I know what? I, we, we have to put a new sign on the back wall there that says, Thank God for commas. That's got to be going <laughs> right. to I think it that. does. It has to be because, Thank God for commas. Oh, that could have been totally <laughs> ridiculous. Richard Brown says, Working at a building full time, shaking hands, going out for a good time in the city, enjoying vacation fully, and hanging out with friends and family. Yep, that's a good oh, stuff. Those man. are good things to miss during COVID. Yeah, I miss those too. Darian's got all the laughing faces, and my mother, of course, <laughs> is calling us gutter. <laughs> yep. But at least you used the commas, Mom. You used the Chris, commas. Chris Mueller said, I miss the smell of cocoa butter and glitter, if you know what I mean. <laughs> and and a good fish in the rectum. And her name is Cinnamon. Yes. And a Welcome good to the stage, everybody. <laughs> Cinnamon. <laughs> oh, uh-huh. boy. Yeah, she'll. Uh, That's funny. She'll I don't care who fish. you are. She'll have a fish for you. Wow. <laughs> that hasn't come through yet, though. I can't share it if it doesn't come through. That's weird. Ah, uh, unless it comes where, through. That's why we're getting... using it. Is that on your watch party? Uh, mine. Uh, yeah. No, that it's actually on the feed. The the feed itself. I see mine on the. Yeah. On huh. yeah. So it's not coming through here. I don't. I'm not getting it in the. Uh, 
the comments. Yeah, we're getting them in like little blasts, yeah, like they ten at really. a time. Well, we're getting them. At least we're getting them. Uh, so, uh, Dan, what was yours, man? What were your top five? Um, I'm going to revise mine from what I sent over, but you didn't pull pictures. That's all good. Um, concerts. We've missed a couple concerts. We're supposed to go to the Bare Naked Ladies concert in Baltimore in August, and that got bumped. Um, live happy hours, like going downtown in Frederick, and you know, and I realize like we can still go out now. Things are opening back up, but I'm I'm not going in a bar. Like like mm-hmm. I'll go somewhere that has a lot of room outside. Yep. They have a really big patio, and that you can. But that's not like going to a nice bar and getting a good drink you know that that's different yeah that is um, different that is different working on films mm, yeah that's that We're, that might not be for a long time yeah that but that wasn't for a long time before like, you're the only one who hires me anymore <laughs> um <laughs> i'm the only one who hires myself anymore <laughs> so there you go <laughs> being there with you guys for apple teenies oh uh, yeah i miss that hey, amen and uh, and hockey, I miss miss the shit out of hockey. But it's, they're back on the ice now, so it seems like maybe by July we might get a playoff. And uh, and movies, I really freaking miss movies, man. Yeah, me too. Going to the movie theater, I love going to the movie theater. You know, I know a lot of people don't do that that much anymore, but I love it. I love going. Yeah, to I enjoy it. Getting the popcorn, getting yep. the candy, watching a good movie with the surround. Feet sticking to the floor. Hmm. I love it. So Chris, the, Chris Mueller's comment finally came in. He misses the smell of cocoa butter and glitter, if you know what I mean. <laughs> and Kevin you know, I Stokes. Did, I, what the hell? All right, go ahead, Dan. I did see somewhere, Chris, that there there was a place that set up uh, drive through stripper clubs. Like they nice. they opened up, and you could drive through and reach out and drop a dollar. You couldn't get a lap dance, but you could still. You get a hood see, dance. Road see trip. Brandy on the, uh, yeah, you get the trip. Snake. Road trip. <laughs> the Tony Katane. Wear your mask. Road trip. We're going. We're going. I'm in. I'm in. All right. You're going to make more? Oh, yeah, man. We got more. I need, I I need an make apple. More. Oh, we need more. Look, Dan's in my head now. Go ahead, Dan. Oh, sorry, around. I'm in the wrong way. Could you ask Johnny G for an apple teeny for me, please? Oh, Johnny, give me an apple teeny. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Easy on the teeny. Easy on Heavy the teeny. Easy on the teeny. All right. So my top five going to the movies, right? I miss that. I love going. I would go once a week or at least try to yeah. go once a week. Um, working on set, obviously, because that's, you know, we can't even do our pickup shots really right now. We want to try and get them done, but, you know, we, you know, we got to figure it out. So we can't get that done. We're, we're working on it, but we're uh, we're stalled right now. Uh, baseball. But I don't miss Major League Baseball. I don't miss that at all. I miss being out with the kids and coaching and playing games, playing games. We did start back up with coaching because the groups are smaller and we divide them up. But um, I miss playing baseball games, being out on the field and playing games. Uh, going out to eat. I miss going out Oops. to eat. Right? Comma. Going out to eat, <laughs> comma, exactly. Children. <laughs> Wait a second. I didn't say that. You said it. Uh, I miss going out to eat. And uh, my number one, my number one is I miss shaking anal hands. Fish. Anal fish. Yes, anal fish. Anal I miss, fish. I miss anal fish. <laughs> no, I said angel fish. <laughs> oh, no, he said anal fish. <laughs> and, he's, and he's right. I don't know. How did you know? <laughs> No, I miss shaking hands and I miss hugging people, man, because that's the kind of person I am. When I see you, yep. you know, I shake your hand, I give you a hug, boom. Yep. I miss that. I miss uh, being around people and, uh, you know, letting people know that, that the people I care about, you know, that, you know, you know I love I, them. I miss, like, the, the people I care about, like, being able to handshake and hug and all that, but... Yeah. I really like not having to shake hands for randoms, you know, yeah. like, like people that I don't, I don't really know. I'm like, ah, <laughs> I, I, go, I understand. I understand that. Um, but yeah, no, but I, I do. I miss, I miss, uh, I miss shaking people's hands and, you know, giving people a hug, you know, people that I know, like going Punching to Actors people. Club, you know, doing that kind of stuff. Just being around people and being able to touch them, put your arm around them, you know, <laughs> eat, and not eat. and eating them. <laughs> Comma. Comma. 
And Johnny Johnny just gave us a, like a, a fixture on the show. Yeah, he did. Oh my god. We need to find a sound bite that says comma. Oh my god. And Kevin Stokes said that was a really heavy pour. Johnny. Yes, it was. Hell yeah. It You're was. welcome. He knows. He Dennis knows. Downs, what's up, man? Dennis Downs. So this guy, Dennis Downs, my uh-huh. oldest oldest friend. From I've known him from Hampton Bay, Long Island. Oldest friend. Great time drinking with him one time. We got drunk on blo- uh, blackberry brandy. Dennis, do you remember that? Comma. Blackberry <laughs> brandy. Comma. It was terrible. <laughs> just that make, went a crazy night. Just make sure was. you're using plenty of commas when you're talking. <laughs> when you're talking, John. <laughs> Comma. Uh, Kevin Stokes says he misses. Uh, they haven't had much change down there in Florida, obviously. Uh, yeah, and the to, numbers show. To miss much down here, but sports and concerts. Yep. Uh, my mom is still. She's ooing again. <laughs> she's on it. Beach closed for two weeks. That sucked. Yeah, it was only two weeks. And uh, my mom said it's not so easy. No. Not so easy, is it? No, it ain't, mom. To uh, you know, not be around the people you love and give them a handshake or a hug or whatever. Right to be close to him, and Johnny, that was a really heavy pour. Thank you, and I'll let you know how it goes, Kevin Stokes. Comma. My son said he gets ten percent on all the thank God for the comma merch. Oh, does he? Does he? <laughs> Do you, Johnny? I sure. don't know. We'll see. We'll have to work that into your contract. You better get your agent. Yeah. You better get your agent on that. You better get your agent. On. We got eighteen people. That's not bad. Yeah. Seventeen people. You know, guys, we broke a record. Right with the two thousand views, mm-hmm. we're up to two point five now. Nice. Which one? The Matt Cerrito one. Okay, beautiful. With, without promoting. Now, if we would have promoted it, it could have been like a billion. Could have been a billion views. A billion? Wow. I'm just a billion saying, views. It could have been a billion views. <laughs> right. It could have been, right? A billion. But the good thing is, is that the ones that we do on a regular basis are up around a thousand views to 1200 every week every time now they're right. they're starting to kick in and kick in and which is fantastic because uh the more minutes and the more people we get the more popular we get and the, yep. you know and uh, we still don't make any money at it <laughs> and people are gonna be people are gonna be bummed and miss this one because when, when when someone comes up and goes dude comma comma you're not gonna know, what, you're not gonna know what's up <laughs> yeah nobody's gonna know it's gonna be an inside joke yep. and if you don't watch apple teens with ken you're not gonna know right you're not gonna know so is if there, you don't get it you don't, you don't get, get it. it yeah yeah so is there anything on the horizon for anybody like johnny anything on the horizon for you anything at all like a yeah. vacation or something yeah next month yeah i, like I turned 50. you turn yep all right Yep, and I'm going to see Sebastian Monoscalco with my son. Oh, cool. Yep. All right. They haven't canceled that yet, so we'll see. Where? Um, I think it's, is it the Lyric, John? Correct me if I'm wrong. I forget where it is. You know what? Yeah, he's funny. He is amazing. Inconceivable! He's amazing. He is my, like, his father is my father. Yeah. I'm surprised Crazy. they haven't canceled that because like, they originally uh, canceled it back in March and then they moved it to the end of July. So, which is kind of, you know, I don't know. I don't know how they're gonna. Oh, we'll see. Yeah, you know, I don't know how they're gonna do that. Yep. Um, let's see, motorboat them. That's right, motorboat. <laughs> Jamie Nash is back to the motorboat people. <laughs> don't shake their hand. Don't hug them. Motorboat them. Mo- I'm in. I'm in. Johnny, <laughs> he wants his ten percent on all that merch. Sounds like Ken wants a hand attachment on that sperm collector. Two things he misses. That's right. Bang. Bang. You nailed it. You nailed it, Chris. That's exactly what I was wanting. <laughs> and have your people call my people. Young Johnny G. All right. Have them call us. Yep. Yeah, we'll work up a contract in our favor. Thank mm-hmm. you very much. What you looking like Chris Pratt? I can't. Like, that was, no, that was his uh, costume for our um, haunted house this past year. Okay. And yeah. my mom is like, where's my cut on the commas? Because she's the one who actually used the smart enough to use the comma. Right. <laughs> <laughs> ah, well, mom. Yeah. And Darian says he'll be acting in a film called Live and Die in Washington next month. Congratulations, Darian. Yeah, nice. yep. That's awesome. And like I said before, please let us know. Uh, share all the possible things, the trailer, everything. Um, behind the scenes photos, whatever you can with us, and we'll share them and we'll get them out there because that's fantastic, man. Celebrate the victories, right? Celebrate the victories. 
That's what we should do, and we should always, and we should always be helping our friends and supporting them and pushing them forward so they can get out there and succeed. So let's make yep. sure we're doing that all the time. My mom says, "Nice, Darian, awesome." So let's make that happen. Doug Mar, what's up, man? What's happening, Thanks for Doug? Him. What else? What else do I have on here? I don't have any more videos though. I don't think I might have one, Dan. I might have one. Uh, a baseball drill. You guys don't want to see a baseball drill, do you? It's kind of boring. You guys want to see Earl Weaver go off on an umpire? Yes. Always. All right. Here we go. Earl Weaver going off on an umpire. One of the greatest managers to ever manage a team, by the way, Earl Weaver. He was fantastic. Um, here we go. Oh, nope. That's that stupid squirrel video again. Here we go. Give it a second. It'll come on. This is hilarious. And Behind the rubber! Oh, and bullshit! And bullshit and yourself! Here. And there he is! And this crew is here just to fuck us! <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Boom! That's good! That's great! And you shut Ah, you and shit! You know, you to get me out of oh, Earl, oh, you run yourself, Earl! You get run yourself! Finger off you hit How tall is Earl yeah, Weaver? Five foot three? Yeah. Yeah. I'm glad you hit me. Look at that guard not going at him. What's that, Earl? To fuck us! Ah, you're full of shit. Fuck you. And don't you ever put your finger on me again. You hit me, Earl. You put your finger on me. That's okay. Did you touch me? I didn't. You ain't gonna knock nobody on your ass. You do it again and I'll knock you right in your nose. I didn't touch you. You pushed your finger. I did not. No, you're lying. God damn it. You're lying. No, you are. You are lying. A lot of piss and vinegar in that little body. And I'll tell you what, you know what the problem with baseball is now? Is they don't do that anymore. They don't. With instant replay, there are no arguments like that anymore. None whatsoever. That is four feet of hate right there. Right? That guy was full of piss and vinegar. Yeah. But I'll tell you what, he won championships. Did he? Yeah, he did. Hell yeah. With the uh, Orioles in the late 60s? Yeah. In the early 70s? Yeah. Hmm. He won championships then, and he won in 1983, right? Whoa. Earl Weaver was still the manager in 1983 gotcha. when they beat the Phillies. I knew that. So Earl Weaver was one of the better managers in the game, right? If I if I was to list the best managers in baseball over the history of baseball, right, you guys that go down are like Earl Weaver, Billy Martin, um, Joe Torre, Whitey Herzog, right? Sparky. Guys like that. <clears throat> Sparky Anderson, right? Sparky Anderson. The guys like that. Um, Connie Mack. Yep. Right. He wore a suit in the dugout. Casey Stengel. Casey Stengel. John McGraw. Yep. Right. These are all. Yeah, I've never, I've never understood why the coach wears the uniform. I it love just it. Never made sense to me. It's I just, love it. Yeah, it's just the way that, it is. Yeah. Yeah, it's just a like what, like what if, if you, you run out of pitchers. Is is uh, <laughs> Johnny Oates going to go in there right. and throw a couple of fungos? Right. And it's just an unwritten rule. Just right. an unwritten rule. Connie Mack used to wear a suit though. Suit and a hat. Chuck Tanner, there you go. Yeah. That's a good Chuck one. Chuck Tanner is a great manager. Yep. Yep. That's what I, I always liked that the Boston guy just wore like a pullover. You know, like, like yeah. The that's, Boston guy. You're the coach. I, I, I can't think of Terry. Terry. Uh, <laughs> what's his name? Francona? Terry Francona? Terry Francona, yeah. Right. He always wore like the pullover. Yep, he yeah. did. He did, or the or the hoodie. Yep. Or whatever. Up. My mom says we need to wrap it up. She got <laughs> Mom's told us what to do. All right, wrap it up, boys. It's Park, like she's yelling Dennis. from upstairs. Right. Wrap it up, boys. Time to go. Yo, Liz Mom. Martin. Dave Krantz. My program's Ooh. coming on, Kenny. Exactly. The George Brett, I shit myself, auto-tone video. I got to find that. Uh, I got to find that. that. My mom wants Earl Weaver's number. Unfortunately. Yeah. His number uh, is six yeah. feet under. Exactly. Six feet yeah. under. He's dead, Mom. Kevin Witt says Chuck Tanner. Yep, yep. great manager. Yep. Great manager. But, yeah, I mean, managers are like... The great managers, you know, they went out there and they fought for their players. And they yep. argued at the right time. They picked the right moment to do it. And they just let the players know that they had their back. And you don't see that in today's game. You don't. Name, name I, a good I manager. Really, Aaron Boone. Nope. I really he, he hate fought the old players they, last year. They get all bent out of shape. And, <clears throat> and like, you, you, you're just here to call balls and strikes, man. Get, don't, exactly. Don't be part of the game. Don't get exactly, your Dan. ego and try to throw someone out for calling you out on your bullshit. Right. Yeah, umpires are terrible. When you know that they're wrong. Yeah, umpires are terrible. They always terrible. have been. And you know what instant replay has proven? 
That is the case. They're that terrible. is the case. Yep. They're terrible. Yep. Terrible. So that's all it's proven. Yep. Um, and you know, you, you can't I know even argue with got, them. Uh, you can't uh, argue with them though anymore. Right. 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 You just can't. Yeah. It's not part of the game now. There's somebody right here in this group that got uh, suspended for arguing with a ref or mm, umpire. I don't know who that was. We're all looking, and yeah, I, I, I know you did, Johnny. <laughs> yes, I did. <laughs> I, I got thrown out of a couple games in my time. I actually got suspended in one league because the umpire told me he was going to kick my ass. Oh. And unfortunately for him, his dressing room was in our locker room. Nice. And I sat there outside the dressing room and waited for him to come out. When he came out, I said, here I am. Go ahead. Yeah. Kick my ass. And, uh, yeah. Uh, he went to the league office, and I said, "Whoa, hold on, man! You said you, you were going to kick yeah. my ass, and I just happened to show up outside the door and say, all 'All right, go ahead.' You know, he didn't Ooh. like that, and I got suspended. <laughs> hmm. I got I suspended got, for that. I got a ten and two um, for arguing with a ref in one game. And the next game, I, I got my third uh, penalty of the night for arguing with a ref for an unsportsmanlike. So I got kicked out of that game." That's fun. Yeah. Look, we've all gotten pissed off in a sport. It's competition, man, right? You're on the edge. You're on the edge, Dan. You want, you, you know, but stuff happens. But it sucks happens. when you know they're wrong and you know you're right. Yeah. You're not going to win that one, though. You know that. We all know that. You're not going to win it. You're not going to win it. So, anyway, I've learned my lesson over the years. I don't argue with them anymore. It's, it's not worth it. It's not worth it. So, I just don't do it. Uh, Chris Mueller says he wants to replace Alexa's voice with Earl Weaver's that's so he pretty can get cool. up in the morning. That's actually that would be, pretty cool. That is funny. Yeah. I would do that. I would do that. Yeah. And Monica says the Italians again. Yeah, both of them got thrown out of games because they got tempers, right? Me? Yep. Not so you can't much. have too many Italians. I don't get, I don't have a temper at all. I do. I don't. I've, I had to I've, go back and fix the fence, remember? I've outgrown that. <laughs> I've outgrown my temper. Sometimes you have to let them know, you know, you do. You have to let the ref know who's boss, Richard. Right, he is. Alyssa Milano. Alyssa Milano? You got to let her know who's boss? Yeah, she's, she's the Samantha. boss. Samantha. She is the boss. Alyssa Milano yep. is the boss. I forgot. Samantha. I forgot. You know, Tony Danza played minor league baseball. He did. He was also a boxer, too, mm -hmm. for a while. Who else played minor league baseball who was an actor? Not me. Uh-uh. Yeah, he did. I don't know, but not me. Can you name anyone? You you have me over him, don't yeah. you? Yeah, that guy. Who? Tom Selleck? Yeah, didn't he? Mm -mm. He didn't play baseball. Nope. He never played minor league baseball. Really? Oh. Kurt Russell. Kurt, I you know what? I knew that. Kurt Russell. You know his kid. His kid played uh, goalie for the Capitals. Uh, he I really? saw him out of Piney Orchard. Really? Wyatt. Yep. And if you watch the uh, Bastards of Baseball. On Netflix, that documentary. If you haven't seen it yet, watch it. It's phenomenal. Does Michael Jordan count? Because he was in uh, that movie with sure. all the Space Jam. Sure. Yeah, Space Jam. Uh, and Chuck he Connors, played like the Rifleman. Thirty-seven seconds of baseball. You know, Chuck Connors, the Rifleman. Yep. Um, what's his name? Tim. Um, he was in Field of Dreams. The redheaded guy, who was the ba the guy who worked at the bank, who was his brother-in-law. Oh, Tim really? Busfield. Yeah, Tim Busfield. Yeah, he, he was in uh, Thirty Something. He played minor league baseball. No okay. kidding. Yep. He did. Um, who else? Uh, the Macho Man was a catcher, wasn't he? Mm -hmm. Randy Savage? Randy? Mm -hmm. Really? Yes, he was. Randy the Macho Man it's interesting. Savage. Chris Mueller said, I got thrown out of a baseball game for wearing skinny jeans. <laughs> it happens. I would have thrown yeah. you off wearing skinny yeah. jeans, too. Yeah, you Just can't saying. wear skinny jeans on a baseball field. Or anywhere. Or, or anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding. Just kidding. All right. Darian said, I meant it to Ken. I don't understand what that means, Monica. Monica said, Darian, I meant it to Ken. Okay, I get it. Hmm. Okay. We're, we're all looking over the comments like, what, is that? Yeah, what does that it. mean? Kurt Howard said, he got pulled from a church basketball league for a chokehold. <laughs> Unfairly, <laughs> Unfairly, though, because the guy didn't pass out. <laughs> <laughs> well, it is what it is, Kurt. You know, mm -hmm. if you want to... You know, just choked him a little harder. Maybe he you you sent him out. a message, though, I bet. Yeah. Don't mess. Don't mess. Don't mess. Yeah. Robin's right. racing. 
We're down to 10 people, guys. We're, yeah. we're running out of time. We're running out of steam. What so time is it? it? We've been on for an hour and four minutes. So oh, wow. it's time to go. Yeah. I think it's time to go. Yep. Do I have anything yep. else to show you guys? So, I really don't. I mean, I could show you uh, this pole dance. Did you guys see the pole dance last week? I think I did. Did you see that, Johnny J? I think I did. All right, where the girl was on the pole and uh -huh. she fell. That's when, that's when Ikea, you really want to follow all the instructions. <laughs> right. I do, right? You got to make sure yep. that you tighten this thing up, all right? right. I'm going to show you right now. You got to tighten this up. Oh, my God. Oh. Uh, she hit the ground pretty hard, too. Yeah. And look, and her mother's her mom, right there. Her mom comes in. Yeah. Janice. Well, hey, so, Hi, Janice. So I have questions. There are, there are questions. Go yeah, ahead. like why why was this show being done for mom? Is this like the you know when you used to do musical theater in your in your living room right. for your folk? And I, it's a, mom, look what I can do! Right? Hey, hold it my just beer. Did place for the pole hey, look, too, though. Mom, no screws. Yeah, look what I can do. <laughs> hey, mom, remember when you used to do this when I was a little <laughs> right? kid? Yeah. Look, I dusted off your old pole. Yeah, it was I'm, in the attic. I'm taking it all. And the, there you go, Chris. There's your fix for the night. And there it is. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my That's god. That's funny. We got a ton of comments tonight, which is fantastic. Yeah. I love when people come on. Yeah. So yeah, but that that chick riding on the pole, uh, I mean it's just ridiculous. But that's what twenty twenty was all about, right? J Lo got on the pole at the Super Bowl and made it look so easy. She's and badass then, though. And then after that, what happened? Everything yeah. just went yeah. right onto the table She's and shit was flipping off the table. We share we, birthdays. You and J Lo? Uh huh. Oh. Yep, She's I like her. Hot. Like yeah, but she's older than Wilford Brimley, and you're not yet. Do you she's think? Do you age. think she uses commas? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go back to that statement my mom threw out there. I miss eating out. <laughs> Comma. Comma. <laughs> Other people. J Lo spinning on a pole. Comma. J Lo. <laughs> 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 oh, I That's just take the stuff. commas out. Just take the commas out, and then you actually get it. Yeah. <laughs> phrasing. Are we not doing phrasing? Phrasing. Yo, commas are key, man. I'm telling you. They are. I'm just saying they are. Oh, Kevin Stokes says it's classic because it is a classic. Yeah, it is. All right, guys. We've been on for an hour and seven minutes. Oh, I don't know how much more I can take of this commaless world that oh, we're wish. living in right now. We need as many commas as we can get. <laughs> Somebody start throwing commas in, please. Comma, 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 slow comma, it down. Chameleon. Somebody slow it down. I get accused of using too many commas. Really? Yeah. yeah my I'm, wife accused I'm me an over commer. -er. You're an over commer? -er? Well, so that yep. stuff like that doesn't happen. Yeah. Well, you don't want stuff like that to happen. No. Because then, you know, you're labeled a child. I don't want to get accused yeah. of eating and, other people. Oh, kids. And then, and then your kids. And then you're on a map. Yeah. Yeah, you're either a yeah. cannibal or a pervert. <laughs> yeah. right. And then you're on a map. Stacy Cooper just joined. Oh, finally, Stacy Cooper. Thanks. And then you have to go knock on your neighbor's doors and introduce yourself. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hi, I'm the pervert who doesn't use commas. Yeah. Right? Okay. We That's love you, Stacy. Marco B just joined. There's an Italian. Yeah, it's up. You know who didn't come on tonight? DeLuca. Yeah, he didn't. Punk. All right. Well, we'll talk to him. I, I missed his news. We got to do some editing tomorrow, anyway. So, we'll be working. So, cool. Nice. We've got yeah. We're putting music underneath of Dan Franco's clowny scenes. Nice. Yeah, it's gonna be awesome. So, I might be painting my deck tomorrow. Painting your dick? What? Why? Uh, it's D E C K. Use a comma. Use a comma. <laughs> D E. Oh, D E C K. I thought you said painting your dick. <laughs> uh, wait a minute. That's nope. inappropriate. I will probably scrub it clean. <laughs> I will, first, I will scrub my dick clean. Second, I will paint it. It will require lots of paint. Lots of hands. I hear there's a machine that can help you clean it. The yes. power washer. They have them in China. Shh. They have them in China. Now, to be honest, those machines are not going to be sold for clinics. They're going to be sold on porn sites. <laughs> That's where the, the business is. And truck stops. And truck stops. Mm -hmm. That's all I'm saying. Yep. That's all I'm saying. Yep. All right, guys. Man, thank you so much for joining me tonight. Dan, Bubble Dan, <sighs> thank you so much for joining. 
uh, Johnny G, thank you for coming out and making these freaking fabulous, fabulous. apple teenies. Whoa. Thank you very much. These vodka teenies, these, uh, what do you call them? Yeah, I would just call them, like, just you call know, them vodka with teenies. apple in it. Vodka with a with an splash apple of green it. and some apple in it. But they were fantastic. And thank you to all the people who came on tonight. What a great audience. What great comments. Thank God my mom uses commas. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, Johnny, young Johnny, for pointing that out. <laughs> yeah. And uh, we appreciate you guys. We'll be here next week. We'll see you at the same time, 8 p.m. I made a mistake and said we were going to do 8.30. I saw that. It confused me. Mm, confused me, too. So next week we'll be back 8 p.m. We're going to have some more fun stuff, <laughs> some more fun videos, some more top five, some more what chaps are ass. We can't wait to be here. Next week, you know who's going to be on the show. We're going to have Tom Selleck. He's back there behind Dan. Oh, yeah. But Tom Selleck's coming on the show if his agent ever calls us back. But if you have any suggestions, anything you want us to talk about on the show, or you have a guest that you want to bring on, or if you want to be a guest on the show, let us know. We'll bring you on, right? I would I would love to have more people on Tell the show. Tell your friends about us, too. Tell your friends about us. Share it. And yeah. go to our YouTube channel and subscribe. Uh, like our Facebook page. That's why we do this, man. We want to get this out. We want to have fun on Monday nights. And we want everybody to have fun. Because yep. that's that's what it's about, man. Yep. Let's try to be positive. Yeah. Right? That's what I like. I yep. like to be positive. You know? Dom Aiello, thanks for joining, buddy. That's my goal in life, Johnny. To make people smile. You know, it's, it's, it's kind of easy. Just At be nice. At least for a little bit. You know, even if it's just for five minutes. Yep. When you are in my presence, I want you to feel good. I want you to smile. I want you to laugh. And I, I don't know. It's just my the way I am. Yeah. So, you know, I, 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 I don't know. The world needs more of it. I don't know. I don't know. That's just who I am. That's yep. what I am. I, I want to make you laugh. I want to make you smile. I want to make you, you know, feel good. So. Comma. Comma. <laughs> Comma. But I don't want to touch you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you for joining me tonight. I appreciate it. We're going to get out of here. Peace. We'll see you guys next week. We're going to take it out of here with Jeremy Ragsdale on the piano. Bang. Apple teenies with Ken. Apple teenies with Ken. Oh, yeah. Apple teenies with Ken. Oh, 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 oh. Apple teenies with Ken, oh, oh yeah, oh, 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 oh.